I'm a good car life. This is the world we live in when we uh, love cars and bikes. We've got bike keys, mini keys, MG keys, back door keys, garage keys. It's just keys everywhere. Everything's just dumped in the garage. So we need a big tidy up. Then we need to pull the mini out. We need to do some jobs. A couple of jobs to do on the bike as well. Hello Bob, we've got the front gate up, he won't go anywhere but that's there to stop him running out and I'll keep an eye on him, Bob's doing his duty, water in the front garden. I've just realised we need yet another key because we need to put that in the garden storage box because I want to clear that out of here along with some other bits. So we're going to have a massive tidy up because at the moment it is a real pigsty and everything's disorganised. Cost of wood at the moment, cost of lumber is meaning the woodworking is taking a bit of a back seat just because I can't build anything to sell because by the time I've paid for the wood and built anything, woodwork is on a back seat people. I don't know if I should fit this yet because I don't really have any friends who have got CD radios but I think it'd be cool retro to go in it so who knows maybe we'll fit that soon this usb socket which will be fitting we'll be replacing the traditional 12 volt socket because at the end of the day it's just unreliable i mean trying to plug things into the 12 volt it never actually works and jiggles around so let's fit a usb socket because everything we plug in there is usb anyway so let's go ahead and fit that usb and this box we have mini spares, so you know, we'll bring ahead and put a mini spares stick on because got the old steering wheel. Uh... Oh, oh, winning at life. What to do with these shelves? Mechanically, things that I need to get to for bikes and cars, oils and the stuff sits traditionally over here. And I've just got junk spread out. So I've got one, two, three, and then four. I'm thinking three things we've got. So we need mini. It's got some gorgeous windows back here. Nice tinted windows, which will go well in the pickup. Then we've got an old exhaust for the bike and the old seat. Um, so I'm, what I'm thinking is Stuff I need to get to most often, unfortunately, isn't a mountain bike, but it should be. But I'm thinking bike, Bob seems to disagree, he's making his umps. Anyway, I'm thinking motorbike, mini, mountain bike, and then the heavy stuff. Helps if I show you. So let's do it again, shall we? So we've got mini, no, motorbike, mini, mountain bike, and then the heavy stuff at the bottom. But for now, we need to get this stuff out here. Some of the bits, like the camping stuff, there will be one tray might put up in the rafters. Obviously, we can't put too much up there, but we've got the frame for the mountain bike. Let's crack on, anyway. Time to start the mini. One of the things I just realised I have are new wipers because the one on it at the moment, the one, 
is actually for the right hand side the left hand side broke off and flew off so I bought new ones which we can fit now because two minute job let's get these out Oof. Dusty, show you up here. Settle. Sure you don't want the concrete floor? No? You good? Alright. Yeah. Come here. Yeah. All right, this busted old one has got to come off and we're going to replace it with this. A bit tacky, I know, but double USB and it also has a built-in voltmeter. Mm, is it going to fit in there? Right, as always, it's a bit scratched up. I'm going to put some paint on that because it's ever so slightly too big. Much better. Let's tidy it up. We need a rear view mirror. We have a rear view mirror. It's a chrome item and I don't like chrome, but uh, it's gonna have to do because I need to see what's behind me. Rear view mirror is done. It's not going anywhere. Got the bottom bolts in and the top one, obviously. Ah, uh, hello. I'm sweating a lot. Check. Check. We still need to do the steering bolt. It's coming together. So look at us, we've got a little dash cam. My parents bought me this, so I think I might as well fit it because a lot of you classic car owners will probably agree that people are just idiots when they see classic cars. So they see a classic car and they do everything they can in their power to get in front of you. It has to be one car. They can't have a classic car, especially a Mini, which they think is slow and they think he's going to hold it up. But they get one car in front of you. And what they do, you'll be coming up to a junction and they'll race to get in front of you. And then they'll put in front of you and slam on their brakes. Slam on their brakes on their brand new ABS car in front of a 45-year-old car with no ABS. It breaks within the given distance it legally has to. However, it's never going to break as quickly as a car of ABS. So when you pull in front of a car, a classic car, that doesn't have ABS, and slam on your brakes, you're asking for trouble. Okay? <laughs> Just get your head out your ass. You don't need to get one car in front for the sake of causing an accident. Alright, we've got one of our memory cards. Plugged into the USB, popped in chill mode. Got the gate at the front so we can't get out. I'm not sure if you can see it, but <laughs> I think he wants to go in a mini. <laughs> when he was a puppy, we picked him up in the mini. I wonder if he remembers it. Or he's just been a nosy boy. Stay close, Bob. Right. Let's plug in this camera now we've got a card in. Hmm. No card. I think the phone there is one. This doesn't seem to like this card. Maybe it's too big. Doing this one handed while I hold the camera. It's always a good idea. That's a 64. There we go. Let's try a smaller one. I've got my gizmo. Make sure to try a 32. It's about as small as I've got. Oh, that card's inside and it seems to be fine. Yeah, 32 gig card. Seems to be a lot happier with that one. Hello, Bob. Not going anywhere. Coming to supervise while I work on the mini. Yeah. <laughs> Tap it. 
Yeah, legend. It's cooling down a bit now, isn't it? I hear a bike. It's going past the main road. The Bob go. Bob's playing with the neighbour. Playing with the fence. <laughs> Little nutter. Bob, Bob. Come on. Oi. Leave him alone. I say playing, he's barking at him. <laughs> he's gone to the garden because he knows what's where he normally is. <laughs> it's such a nutter.